Hello everyone, welcome to my train room. Here's another video on my Hornby 00 layout. Today I'd like to demonstrate my my latest addition to the layout and this is it. It's a, a box diagram I believe is what it's called or similar to that anyway. It's simply made from the a blow up of the, uh, the original diagram that I used to, to make the uh, to make the layout. But this one actually has some light lighting in there and uh, and uh, showed you the route that the trains take. Well, let me demonstrate that. Here we have my points controls, and these are my running lines, the main four lines I have. And I have the, another line which is what I call zero, which is all the, uh, the, the, the marshalling yard and uh, all the uh, stations, etc. Okay, so if I want to uh, take a, a train from line one and bring it in, I call it in, that'll be into the line zero. I just click the points, the points of train, you just hear them, and then the lights. If you can see if they show it well, there they are. So you can see there, follow the light around. Now what it's doing is the train has to go around the reversing loop. So it's, this is line one, it's coming along, it's come into line zero, going around the reversing loop, it has to go around there so it can be facing the right direction again. Because obviously it doesn't turn around at another station anywhere. It, uh, it stays on the up line or the down line and returns on the same line. Okay and when I when I cancel the points out, the points close, open or, or whatever and the lights go off. So let's uh, let's demonstrate this in practice then. Okay I'll bring a a train out from uh, my LNER station onto line one. So that's the points. There we go, and there's the route it'll take. It'll come here's the LNER station. It'll come out this way. When the there they are, and it will come out and go around there and out onto onto that section onto the line one. So it's on line zero now, and this is the point where the first light is on there. And there we go, it's going out, and now it's just crossed over onto line one. Back to the diagram and the controls, and so we'll cancel out these points. And when it comes around, I can bring it in again. So I can bring it in from line one to line zero. In. And you just have to wait for it to come around. It can't be long. Oh, but uh, as you can see, the little come in around there, and then go around the reversing loop, and then back to this point here, which is where my signal box is. So here we go. There we go. Come again. Cancel the points out, of course. The other points will work automatically. And then uh, I need to choose the, the platform it's going to go into. And there we go. Back to the back to the station. There. Sorry about the train driving. Then I have to control the camera and the. Train. 
So let's do another one. Here's uh, line four. You can do eight different routes. You can see there. This is coming. This is line four, and there it goes on to line zero, and then comes to this area again, which is where the where everything starts. The uh, the marshalling yard and the stations all have to come via that point to go out onto the main running lines. Now up here you can see I've made a little motorised uh, I don't know, uh, switch there, motorised uh, switch of some sort. I forgot what you might call that. Anyway, and there's the back. A bit dark now, but you might be able to make out. There you can see the motor, and there's a lot of relays there. A lot of wiring, obviously, because there's over 60 volts. Yeah, thank you very much for watching my video.